Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad and welcome back to Donkey Kong Country Returns. Let's get into Cog Jog, the first of three squared levels for some reason. So let's take a look at that. Also, I need to quickly just say that things might be a little bit different because of I, I, I already recorded these episodes and then found out that I had an extra audio input that I didn't set up, which was one frame out of, the, out of sync with everything else. So I had to replay the whole game up to this point, but it's fine. It was actually pretty good because I knew what I was doing. And now I know what I'm doing in this as well, so. Although I am going to forget what I need to do, so I'm going to grab all these bananas. So let's go ahead and do that. Basically, if you have a source clone, make sure that you got the audio correct. And we slam you three times, get a coin. Blow this fan. Also, you can blow most things in one breath, so you don't have to stand there and wait for it all the time. Now there's the K. I think we can just jump to it. Like we can just go into the barrel for us. We don't have to wait too much. We can shoot all these. Bounce back into the cannon. <laughs> Last time I did this I tried to avoid the cannon and just jump around. That's not what you're supposed to do. Also if I can hit this fan that'd be- no the light that'd be good. It's just a banana. There's also a barrel down there we can jump into. So that's good. Also this music is so good. I'm so glad that this music is here. It's so chill and it's amazing. Such a good classic. Oh my goodness. I love the music in this game. So much. I still need to go listen to it outside of the game. But I also played through the game again. So I also just listened to it all again. Also I have a feeling I needed a barrel soon. But I don't know if I need it yet. I don't think I need it yet. But you can also carry it most this way, except that when the, when you slide, you also drop it, so it's hard to take it all this way. I had to go back for one. My first time through here. Now, where do I need a barrel? The easiest barrel is actually just this, this Kong barrel. But you also have to get it around things. So let me just take my time on this. Okay. Don't slide around too much. There's also a barrel there, so I probably don't need to be too careful. Let's go in this pipe. Got a minigame. It's also interesting when you go through all the minigames again, because... Sometimes you'll still struggle with some of them, because you miss one banana that you should have gone for. Or you still fall in the pit, because that's very possible. Or you shoot into the barrel. Basically, never underestimate the minigames. You always have to always be prepared for the minigames. But anyway, we also need to get another barrel, which we can get right on the next platform. Wording is hard. Also, puzzle piece, thank you. Oh, careful. Very careful. Okay, we need to get it up this, I think? Or maybe further beyond. I should have waited before doing this. I think it's actually further beyond, so let me just take a second. I think it's up this way. Which is going to be easier said than done by the looks of it. Yeah, there it is. No, I broke- it broke immediately! 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 It's fine. I should probably have used that barrel to tr at least have two attempts at this. Per life, but that's okay. I'm also going to try and get this other stuff first if I can. So we're going to jump up here. And then figure out how to get around. There we go. There we go. And all the way up here is another puzzle piece. Okay, now we can have a look at this other thing. I'm just gonna blow this enemy. Get out of the way. Okay. Gonna wait for the platform to come around again. No, why did you do that? I, I didn't even move the controllers. It's just like one jostle. It's fine. Also, there's the only time in the game that I think I've seen a Kong letter that we've already collected, which is quite interesting. I said that last time too, but I wanted to point it out again because I forgot about it. I need to be careful. So careful. I know this is with the Kong barrel, so I have two attempts at this, but still. Throw. Got it. You can't have to throw it early because otherwise you're gonna get slided off of the thing. Also, there's a banana arrow here. 
And this background looks really cool. You really want to note the backgrounds, because some of these backgrounds actually mean stuff. So just, just, just notice that. I don't know. But anyway, because we slammed on this thing here, we can make it spin. And we can go down. Because there was a sign at the beginning of the level that said, find the button. There's a button here. Which we need to slam, to activate. We have to actually make sure we find this in the level, otherwise we have to go back through the level again and activate it. It's not something we can miss, but you can't you can still get to the end of the stage, but you have to go back for it still, so... I think I said that right. It's fine. Take that. Very nice. Man, it's so weird to be back here after, like, oh, so long. Last time I was here, I was playing Tears of the Kingdom for my first time. Well, last time I saw this in a playthrough that I didn't play. I mean, I already did... Uh, oh my goodness, calm down. How do I... I think I can go back from this way. I did also just do this on my own playthrough that I had to redo, but still. The last time I... yeah. I'm just reminiscing of the past. It's fine. A lot happens. In this time. Okay. Also, I love this. This is something I've been looking forward to forever. Is these green chains. Which are the vines of this world. I just love that. That's such a good way to keep the vine concept. But in a world that is so mechanical. It's just perfect. Once we have all the puzzle pieces, we need the G still. That's just the best thing. I've been really looking forward to that. Okay. It was worth playing through the whole game again just for that. Just for the chains. Now, where do we need to go? It's down here. Probably gonna wait for this, just to be safe. Go, it's fine. Also, something else that future me, or past me, either way, either or, something I learned is that I can probably just, I should wait, probably just use the life extra heart item, because we're probably not going to use it for anything specific otherwise. So it is just worth using them, basically. Don't, don't, don't hoard them too much. Gonna jump. I really love this music. I know it's not even in the main music section, but I'm I still have to say. Because it is just that good. Ba 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 ba. I'm gonna jump. It's fine. Okay, now we wait for this one. Except this is right there, so we're gonna take it anywhere. There's the G, so we have to get around it inside of this thing. Might just jump over this way first. That's definitely gonna miss time this whole thing, but it's fine. Maybe I should just jump from over here because that's where the camera is. Grab. No, don't fall. Why? Sliding. You have to be very careful sliding in this world, in this game. Okay. Grab the thing. That's not even. Okay. Just gonna be, just gonna be patient. Patience is the thing. Okay, and just keep jumping. Just keep jumping. Just keep jumping. Just keep jumping. Jumping is a good deterrent from sliding. There we go. Got it. And there's the end, of course, right there. Nice. That worked out way too well. As things do for me, for some reason. I mean, sometimes they go really bad, but sometimes they go really good. My luck is crazy. But anyway, because we hit the button in the level, the lights activate. If we don't, if, if we don't hit the button, they don't activate, but we can still go to the next level. So that's how that works. Switcheroo! Let's go! Oh, is this the one that I'm thinking about? I think it is. This is also a level I've been looking forward to for a long time. That I've had to play, play twice now, but... This is a good level, so it's worth it. it was, it's worth it 
for the levels. We have these switches that we have to press to change which thing is active between red and blue. And we have to platform around that. Because we can't go through the walls. Unless they're- but sometimes we can, which is the problem, because we need the platforms. And how do I get up there? I mean, I can probably just roll and jump. Like that. Need to take out these enemies. Like that. And there we go, bonus. Ba, 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 ba. I timed that really badly. Da, ba, da, ba, da, ba, 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 da, ba, ba. Also, the music for the bonuses is actually... It's quite interesting hearing the different ones for it, because there are different ones. I'm gonna go up first for that last banana, because otherwise it's gonna be a lot harder. I should have been way more careful with that last jump there, but it's fine. It worked. My confidence is probably a lot higher than it should be. But it's okay. Also, just hit the thing. Thank you. Also, we don't- I don't think we can take out this enemy. But that's okay, we can stun it. Which is alright. Give me nothing, cool. Okay. Okay, switching platforms. This is so cool, I love the way that these platforms look. They're so, um, so bright coloured. It's very nice. Also, hey, a tyre. We've only seen tyres pretty much in the Banana Temple or the Kong Temples. Not Banana Temples, Kong Temples. Gotta get that right. Oh boy, this is interesting. Ah, uh, this is fine. Let me just send all of these things to their death. And then we can go up through the middle of that, so we can actually hit, grab the this. Because anytime we go through the switches, we have to hit the switch again. To re-enable the platform. But if we can't avoid the switches, then we have a problem. Okay. Also, notice the background here. It may look very familiar to us. Very familiar indeed. As pointed out in the last stage, you want to pay attention to those. Let's go down here. Because here's another switch. Another button. It's so cool that that does that. I love that so much. I love a lot of things about Donkey Kong Country Returns. I'm actually kind of glad that I get to play through it again for this because of messing things up. Because I get to re-experience all of this again. Also, if we jump up here, we can't just jump up to the next platform. Uh, but if we roll and jump, we can. Just like that. Puzzle piece. Very nice. And we also have to hit the thing again so we can actually go places. I'm falling down. It's fine. All part of my plan. That's why I left those bananas there the whole time. Trust me. I know the strats of not strats. There we go. We had to make sure that this was out of the way so we could actually progress. Blow this. Now this one's interesting because we actually need to stay up. We can go down, which is probably easier. But we want to be able to roll up to here. For this bonus. Man, these backgrounds are so cool. Go. I'm glad that the timer pauses when you have all the things selected except for the puzzle piece. It just makes sense. Now let's blow these. Get this wall out of the way. And let's keep going. Oh my goodness. Now with tires. I mean, this is fine, right? As long as we go back through. So we can just collect these bananas, but we have to be careful. Oh my goodness. This is fine. That's very scary. But we're fine. Also need to do something about these enemies here. So let's just push them out of the way. And they're gone. Very nice. Checkpoint. Very nice. Okay. Now we have these platforms to deal with. Let's go up here. What platform was that? It's blue. Activate it. Oh, I went too far. But that's okay because there's also a one up there. 
Delete that and reset. It just works. This is I, like I've, I'm amazed by the amount of design in this game. It's really well done. I'm just gonna go underneath that. I still get hit. That's fine. Down, duck. Let's go. Need to go through these switches so we can get to the other side. Just like that. That was dangerous, that's okay. Okay, we need to switch this around. Just gonna let that do its thing. So, let's jump. Probably could have gone back up to the other thing, that's fine. We can also go through that. It's a little bit more dangerous, but it's fine. I love the chains again, I have to say that again. Okay. I think I can throw one of these chickens at this other thing, but I'm probably gonna hit the other one. No, I didn't. Okay. Good stuff. Now, I think this is close to the end, but there's one more thing over this way for us. Puzzle piece. I think we have everything now. I'm gonna be so sad to say goodbye to this music again. It's so good. But anyway, here we go. That's the end. Oh my goodness, so many extra lives we can't keep. I wish that it converted extra lives that you don't get into coins or something, so you just get something back. But also, we don't need any more coins we get anyway, so it's fine. There we go. Also, these levels get quite long. Which I quite like. Long levels are good. Music Madness. This is good. I probably will take an extra health though, since we have so many. I was able to get through a lot more of the game without needing power-ups or stuff. Well, I guess I only used it for bosses, didn't I? I could have used it for so many more things. Anyway. Cool music is cool. Let's get into this restricted access room. Puzzle piece. Gotta find another button. We also have these hammer things that are in rhythm with music. So you have to do that. Which I think we can also get on top of this, but I don't think there's anything up here. Fortunately for me. Also, the hammers can still hurt you when they're above, so you have to be very careful where you stand. Okay. You wanna go underneath the hammers. You don't wanna go over the hammers because it will hurt. Activate this. I'm gonna cannon. Oh, we have to time this. Gonna wait for it to slam again. And then... What's the music? Oh my goodness. Gonna go up here, because there's a bonus. We could probably have gone to the end of the, the row. And I think it'll be an easier way up, but we can also just go up. So I'm gonna do that. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Okay, let's keep moving. That was not an easy way up. We had to just jump up. That's fine. We could have jumped up from this side though. We're, we're safe. Also, cool background thing. But I don't think that's important to us. So we're fine. Put on this. Just gonna break that. Throw that away before it explodes on me. Okay. Moving platforms. Also, I need to be way more careful than I am. Saw that puzzle piece. Have to go down for it. Oh, no! It moved! It moved and I moved. How convenient. I don't know. Was well, this weird how many stages they give you the Kong barrel when you don't need it? Because you're in a minecart and you don't have one hit point anyway. Gonna be uh, extra careful. I was so good at this part last time I came through here. Roll jump. Don't need these bananas, which is good. If we needed all these bananas, we'd have a serious problem. Grab the O. Okay, checkpoint. Also, 
if I can get up, I can get a big banana bunch. Like that. Not that we need it, but I wanted to grab it anyway. We have so many lives that we don't need. This music is so cool. I got bumped off the edge. There was not enough space to stand next to that thing, apparently. That's fine, we, could, we just got a checkpoint. We don't need to worry about missing anything here. This is where we got it all. Okay. Just gonna avoid this thing. I love mechanical stuff so much. It's really cool. There's the end. I think we can go down here as well if I don't get too close to the enemy. Ow. Good thing I had that extra health. Drop down there, there's a cannon to catch us. Okay, go. Probably need to go a little bit faster. Okay, we're good. Another checkpoint. I haven't found the button yet though, so we need to find that still. Also, I believe this ice blast doesn't hurt us, but it, it, it pushes us up, but the fire... The fire's a thing you need to avoid. You can avoid both, but... You don't have to worry too much about the... The ice breath, whatever it is. Just gonna grab that, got Kong. I imagine there's something in that light... That I want. Let's grab that. No, it's just a coin. But we do need to drop down here, except I exploded myself. Right next to a heart, too. That's fine. I don't think we lost that much progress. Just a little bit of progress. I should be more careful. <laughs> okay, let me just get rid of this thing. Get this heart back again. Let's go down. Oh, because the background there in the background is the background. I see. It all makes sense now. Let's activate this generator. I didn't even notice the background. I was supposed to be paying attention to the background, and I was not. But the background up here was the same as the other places that have the generators. So there we go. Out fire. It's fine. Okay. Big drums. Big drums, big hammers. Big dreams. I don't know. It just feels like a saying for some reason. Big drums, big hammers. Also, bigger hammers. Which we want to use to launch ourselves around. We have to be very careful when we're near them. Ow. Very careful. What I probably wanted to do was actually land and then roll past it. Never mind. And the generator stays done. So I don't have to redo that. Okay. Let's go. Very carefully. No, don't get too, too close. Bounce me up. To victory. Also, I don't want to touch the hammer in midair because that will still hurt. Which is the main reason I was trying to get underneath them. No, I should have waited. It's fine. Okay, just take your time. I can wait for it to start coming back towards me before I go past it, probably. Which would probably make the most sense. Like that, there we go. I had no trouble with this last time, so I don't know why I'm having trouble with it now. Yeah, that works so much better when you wait for it to come towards you. Just like that. And there's the end. Got a coin. I don't know how you can time that good. But there we go, another level down. And that should be all three switches hit. To activate the next area. Next thing that we have to do. We got ourselves a rocket. All powered up. Also, apparently it doesn't count towards the bonus stage that we have to do. But let's do... Lift off launch.
I've been looking forward to this a little bit. It's a lot shorter than I remember it being, but it's really cool. Also, that background is really cool. <laughs> Look at that. It's got all the generators on and stuff. I wonder if it lets you in this level without having to activate the switches, which would be cool. I'd love to see that, actually. But also, I'd have to play through the whole game again to check that. I imagine it does, which would be cool. But anyway, that's a rocket barrel out of this rocket. Don't have to worry about any collectibles, it's just getting to the end. Pretty sure, anyway. Also, we need to press A to go up. Instead of... It, it's, it's, it's normal A to go up rules, but in a vertical rocket barrel stage. And sometimes you will want to be up on the screen. So you have to learn this now. It's not just for show, also we need to avoid all these. It's hard to tell what's background and what's foreground. But these are definitely foreground. Otherwise this would be way too easy. Also look at the moon! Looks so cool, also I need to just avoid that, okay. There we go. Very short, but very cool. And and it's a little bit of practice for stuff. But hey, we have a launch up all the way up to the boss. But first I'm gonna go do the... The Kong Temple. Treacherous Track. Oh, it's this one. Right. This one is a bit of a familiar kind of Donkey Kong stage, in a way. It's got its own unique twist on it, though. And it's got a lot of trap coin collection points. So if you see a thing that you want to smash open for for a puzzle piece, it's probably just a coin, don't worry about it. Let's go. On the rails. We have to hit these switches to activate the track in front of us, though. So we have to make sure we do that. Unless it stops the at the end of the track. I don't think so, though. Duck. But yeah, all of the things we can get for bonuses, I think, is just... Coins. The coins are harder to get than the puzzle pieces, for some reason. It doesn't seem right, but it, that's what it is, so... I think if you time your jumps right, you can get it, but you'd have to time it just right. Okay, down. Hit switch. I want to go down for this thing here. No, it went in the background! I didn't think it was going to do that. I go, okay. I didn't notice that last time that I did this. So I have to get the puzzle pieces before they go into the background as well, if they come from the background. So you have to get them quick, when the tr the track is moving quick. Got it. You've got to be kidding me. I got stuck between the things. It's a good thing it gives us Diddy. Okay, go, 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 got it. Gotta be very careful though with these platforms sinking into the ground. Or falling down. Puzzle piece. We also need to go down for that switch though. Don't miss that. It's also nice that once you have the puzzle pieces collected, you don't have to recollect them, so you don't have to worry too much about that. And you can just focus on living. After everything else is done. I think we have most of the puzzle pieces now, so we don't have to worry about that. Let's just live. Also have to hit this one, right there. Puzzle piece. Just go, just go, just go, duck. Switch. Oh my goodness. Switch. Down for switch, instead of up for switch. Which is interesting. And I think we're at the end. I think we got everything, nice. That worked out pretty well. Orb! Give me the shiny! One more to go. But anyway, I think that's probably it for now, so thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all next time.